Today we're going to talk about the defender parts and, well not the defender parts, we're going to talk about where we buy our defender parts, maybe for the maintenance or the accessories or some parts for the driveline, suspensions, transmission, whatever. So we have some kind of favourite uh, websites or shops, uh, not for every part, but uh, we're going to I'm going to let you know on which website or which shops we trust the most uh, concerning our Defender. So for the maintenance and services, uh, we almost buy all the parts from Paddock Spares. I'm sure you know Paddock Spares if you own a Defender. So they have good prices, the shipping fee is quite low, so that's a good point. Um, there's there's not much differences uh, if we buy the product in France or in the UK, so that's a good point for us. But uh, concerning Paddock Spares, we don't really like their website because it's a bit difficult to research the parts. If you have the reference parts, it's great, so you can find it really easily, but if you don't have it, it's a bit um, complicated. So, like this you will know. Um, in fact, most of the time we order our parts on websites depending on how it is easy for us to find, to find the parts. And we do also check the shipping fee because sometimes you can have some bad surprises when you want to check out. So Paddock Spares is good for the maintenance uh, parts. Concerning oil, so this depends on um, the time we need the oil, uh, we do try to look a bit on the internet, but we mostly go in some shops around here where we can have some good prices. For the tyres, it's a bit the same as the oils, so it depends on the time uh, when we do need uh, the, some tyres and also the type of tyres. So sometimes we order them on the internet, and sometimes we just buy them uh, here in Switzerland um, in some specific tyres shop. Now concerning anything that would be engine related, we go for a live tuning. Would it be for a remap, an exhaust, um, turbo hoses, uh, intercooler? You can, you can check out a live tuning. They, are, they provide um, a good customer service also. Now, the wear parts, we order wear parts from bestofland.fr, so they have a well-made website, it's really easy to search the, the parts, they also write uh, the compatibility for every vehicle and if there's a specificity on that part. Now the drive line. so I am absolutely sure you know who we go for when uh, we talk about the drive line, and it's Ashcraft. They have a good website and they produce their, their own heavy duty drive line parts and also considering the heavy parts that they will send you, they do have a correct shipping fee, so that's quite good. For the suspension parts, we go for Euro 4x4. It is really easy to find the parts on their website because we only need to enter uh, our chassis number and then you have the list of all the parts available for the vehicle. So that's really a great point when it's easy like this to research a part. Also for the driveline and the suspension, you can check out Win Lewis. He manufactures some well-made and tough parts, so you can go check out Gwyn Lewis. Now, uh, if you are looking for some specific parts to improve the functioning of your vehicle, you can go for Nugget Stuff. We met him in Brisbane when uh, we were in Australia for a road trip and he is really nice. He does provide a great customer service and the parts that he manufactures are really well thought and well made. So he has a really great sealed air box and also a breather manifold kit. So 
you should take time and check out his products. But uh, he recommends to order his parts from first of all because of the shipping fees. Yeah, the shipping fees when you order directly from Australia are quite expensive, are very expensive. So he recommends to order everything from first of all if you're not in Australia. There and also uh, for the specific parts to improve your vehicle, you can check out Nakata Naga. <laughs> I just can't say that word. Nakata Nakata Nenga. There. Nakata Nenga. Okay, <laughs> I did it. So you can check out Nakata Nenga. It's a German website, I think. And they do also provide uh, some improvement parts, but also outdoor accessories. Um, we have ordered from them the Ali box that is on the roof rack. And the last uh, interesting websites and shops that we like for the accessory, general accessories, are Flat Dog and OffroadAttitude.fr. So Flat Dog, you might know them. So they sell many brands and they also do have their own brand that is quite good. Their prices are okay and they also have a, a great website. Offroad Attitude also has a great website and they do sell many Aussie brands such as ARB or Frontrunner. They have great customer service and their website is really well made. Uh, we ordered lately some new rims from them. And the two last uh, shops that I want to talk about is for the interior accessories and it will be MudUK. They do manufacture uh, cool interior accessories and electric accessories, so it's um, nice to go and check them out. We did bought our switches from them and we are very happy with our switches. And last, the electric supplies. So concerning the electric supplies, we found that on 12 volt planet, they do have good quality products. So we always buy our stuff over there. So there, these are the main shops that we like when we, go, when we have to buy something for our Defender. So I hope this will be helpful. And please let us know which shop do you prefer. Do you know these websites or shop? Have you ordered something from them? If yes, what? Uh, if you have some other shops that you know and that you trust and had a good experience and bought some quality products, Please comment below to let me know, uh, maybe we should also have a look on other websites, but those ones are the main ones. We do some research also, and sometimes we find some new websites, but for today, those are the main ones that we like the most. Today we decided to prepare a beef stew for midday. So we have some carrots, potatoes beef meat and we'll put some herbs and cook it for about three or four hours. There guys, so we're finishing this uh, daily vlog for today. Um, it was uh, not it wasn't an exciting day today uh, i the, i've done a lot of work um, on my computer the children played together and we were still waiting to have some information from the teachers so we had some information from jad's teacher and we will be able to get uh, the work that she needs for this next month but nothing for volcan so that's where we are with school um, in Switzerland, there are much more restrictions now. Um, everything started today, so most of the shops are closed now. You can go to the groceries, banks, post office, uh, of course hospitals and doctors, but you have to stay at home the most, pos the most often possible. So today it's what we did. Uh, we only went uh, to the grocery store 
to have a look <laughs> so you will see the footage uh, of what we've seen in the grocery store next to our uh, not so far from not so far from our place and it's quarantine time so we did stay a lot at home um, the children played together we cooked uh, the children are making some bread now and it's kind of the end of the day so um, the next day we will try to do some work on the Defender I hope you did enjoy all the websites and shops, shops that we've talked about before. Do let me know what you think about them. Have you already ordered some stuff on those websites or do you have some other ones that you like and you would like to share with us? Please comment below to let me know like this. We could also have a look on other websites. And there, so I will talk to you tomorrow. And also, I forgot to tell you again, uh, concerning Switzerland, they closed the borders. So it's going to be a difficult time for everybody. But we will adapt, so I hope you're doing fine. Don't forget to wash your hands and stay at home the most possible. Okay, bye! Talk to you soon. Uh, vlog. Vlog? Vlog. Vlog. <laughs>